Hi Upload and welcome to the Destiny Beta. All week long we are going to be dropping a ton of Destiny coverage and delving deep into the beta to give you all the information you could possibly want. So be sure to keep it locked to Upload all week. That's right. Now, Destiny is a shared world shooter with a vast environment for you to explore. You can go out alone or explore it with friends. And for the competitive players out there, there's the Crucible. But before you get started, you're going to need to make your Guardian. So in today's video, we are going to talk about the races and classes of Destiny. The three races are Human, Awoken and Exo. Each can be either male or female and have a host of visual customization options. My personal favourite is the Awoken, so look out for me in the beta and the final game. Now, whichever race you choose, you get access to one of three different classes, Titan, Warlock or Hunter. Now, within these classes, there are three different combat stats, Armour, Recovery and Agility. Armour is your defence. Recovery is the rate at which you regenerate health and Agility is your speed and jump height. Now, the Titan is your heavy armoured guy, your tank. They have the best armour stats, moderate recovery and low agility. The Warlock on the other hand is your caster, your space magician and it has low armour and agility but has extremely high recovery so that helps outweigh how squishy it can be in battle. And the Hunter is your roguelike character with extremely high agility but very low armour and recovery so again quite squishy like the Warlock but extremely fast. But that's not all. In the final game each of them will have three subclasses but in the beta only one is active. For the Titan that's Striker. In this subclass, you have access to a range of grenades, the Fist of Havoc superpower, which is kind of like an interstellar Hulk smash. Exactly. The lift ability, which acts like a floating double jump, and a unique melee attack, which is a devastating punch. Now the Warlock subclass is Voidwalker. This will also give you access to a range of grenades, as well as the Nova Bomb superpower, which is like a big plasma bomb that disintegrates your enemies. The glide ability, which is similar to that of the Titan's lift, and a punch that looks something like a force push. Lastly, the Hunter subclass is the Gunslinger. This gives you access to a range of grenades, the Golden Gun superpower, which summons a flaming pistol that kills enemies in one hit, the ability to double jump, which you can upgrade to a triple jump later on, exactly, and a melee attack that has two forms a throwing knife for range, and an up close stab for those sticky situations. Now the Hunter's actually the class that I've been playing as most in the beta so far. I'm really enjoying it, I like how kind of fast paced it is. And the double jump means it's actually quite a lot quicker to sort of traverse over the level, so I find it really, really good in PvP as well. And the throwing knife is a lifesaver. The amount of times that I run out of ammo, throw it. So yeah, this is definitely my class that is kind of my favourite class so far. Anyway, that's it for this video. That's everything you need to know about the classes and races in the Destiny beta. Be sure to add the official Upload Gamertag as a friend to stay up to date with all of our latest videos and keep it locked to Upload all week for much more Destiny coverage. Thanks for watching and we'll see you on Upload.